I'm going to demonstrate for you today the basic installation of the NQ kit, as you can see here. Now, the NQ kit is a very handy contraption that contains a DC fan, a set of heaters, and a nice simple thermostat, which works very well together, to make any little box like this styrofoam container into an incubator. You could use a cardboard box or a wooden box, a glass box, whatever, and with this little NQ kit, make it into an incubator. Now, I have used these personally to hatch eggs, quail eggs, which are very difficult, very sensitive eggs, and I've had very good success with it. You can find these online. Uh, just type in NQ kit, I-N-C-U-K-I-T, in eBay or in Google, and you'll find what you're looking for. Now, very simple. You've got to take this shaft, find where you want to put it, whether it be in the, the top roof of the incubator or the wall. I've chosen the wall here. I've punched a small hole here. I've punched two mounting holes here, just with a simple awl. You can use a screwdriver, whatever will go through, styrofoam pencils, pens, whatever. Take this, mount it into place here. You can then use two simple screws or every up to four simple screws that again will mount into the, the holes in the mounting plate and plug those into the plate through the styrofoam. I like to use these small plastic connectors. They work very well because they're nice, easy to remove, but they also easily snap into place just like this. And just like this, I have now mounted the NQ kit into the styrofoam container, making it effectively a very nice incubator. The dongle connects to the AC-DC adapter, which comes with the kit, kind of nice. And it's low, 12 voltage, so you don't have a lot of high volts going through your very damp incubator. Won't hurt your chicks or yourself, that's kind of nice. Probably can't hear that fan, that's a good thing, nice and quiet, but it's working. And the heaters are heating, and this thing is now going to be heating up this enclosure. You can put the knob that, that uh, turns the thermostat makes it very easy to regulate with a small screwdriver turn that into place and just like that you're ready to go now I like to use the eggometer a nice little contraption that uh, <coughs> simulates the egg what's going on inside the egg very nicely I have found them very effective put the lid on I have put uh, the small glass panel embedded into this the top of this uh, styrofoam lid and just like that I have a good, working, effective incubator. And again, I've used these. They work great online. InQ kit, and you'll find what you're looking for.